hello students welcome you all on your pedia education my dear students if you are preparing for nic exam as you already know your pedia already started the most important question series which are very relevant to your upcoming nic exam so in this video i am going to tell you about some of the problems from the subject computer network which are very important you may face these type of problems in your upcoming exam start with the problem first is match the following so we have some list 1 and list 2 and we have to match accordingly so here first is data link layer in list 1 we have the layers name and the in list 2 their corresponding data packet or data frame data segment name fine so if i talk about the data link layer in data link layer we are talking about the frame fine so first is b in network layer we are talking about the packet and in transport layer we are talking about the segment fine data start from the application layer and in each layer we add data as well as its own header so we give name to that particular entity at different layer different name data link layer frame network layer packet and transport layer segment so that is the right answer Moving towards the next problem, which of the following is true? We have to find out the true statement. Now, see, listen carefully. This is an important problem. TCP is a connection oriented. This step is the right one. So, packet follow the same path from sender to receiver. No. It doesn't mean that if it is a connection oriented protocol it means before sending the data we have to establish a connection between sender and receiver but it doesn't mean that each and every packet always follow the same path so it means first one is the false next http packet follows same route from sender to receiver again it is false why because http uses tcp protocol so if it is a tcp protocol it doesn't mean that it is a connect it if it is a connection oriented then they both follow the same path it means neither a nor b are true fine so this is a very important problem keep in mind because many of the students have doubt that if we make a connection then each and every packet always follow the same route that is the wrong the next statement is again we have the match the followings data link layer their functionality func physical layer their functionality and network layer their functionality so if we talk about the data link layer what it can do we know that it detects the error so see physical layer we know that it is used to maintain the circuit and network link layer router is there perform the routing so these are the match of the following true options so each layer one side one side their functionality moving towards the next problem that is which of the following statement is invalid oh okay this is talk about the invalid statement about the tcp so tcp is a byte stream protocol true it send the data in the form of byte it support multicasting no this is not true it support unicasting and next is tcp suffer from yes tcp tcp suffers from silly window syndrome problem what is silly window syndrome problem you can watch my lectures I, that is already available on the your pedia platform so yes tcp suffer from silly window problem so again this is the true one and this is the false so question talk about invalid it means b is the correct options so these are some of the important problems or some of the problems which you may face or or i can say these type of problems will ask in your upcoming exam of nic if you are comfortable with the basics or the concept then hardly it will take 10 to 20 second to solve each and every problem so my dear students still date is not announced and if you want to prepare for the nic exam 
you can join our your pdf module that is dedicated module for nic thank you so much